Hey there, viewers. Eggs are a bone of contention for many people. Some say they have too much cholesterol, while others love them as a good source of protein. Whatever your reason for liking eggs, they're definitely delicious. But are they that good for you? In today's video, we're going to discuss just that. Let's review eggs for what they really are. Do the benefits outweigh the negatives? Are they really high in nutrition? Does cholesterol from eggs affect your blood cholesterol levels? Well, we'll discuss all of this and more. Watch until the end. Eggs are a standard breakfast. If you go to a diner in the morning, it's very rare to see a plate that doesn't have some sort of egg on it. Eggs are a favorite worldwide. I mean, can you really blame anybody? There's just so much to love about them. For one, you get just 78 calories from a single egg. They're an excellent source of protein and vitamins. You get about six grams of protein for each egg and a generous amount of vitamin D. But there are some risks to eggs you need to know about. People with diabetes and heart problems need to watch the cholesterol in eggs. But this doesn't mean cholesterol found in eggs is your enemy. You just need to be careful if your diet already has a ton of cholesterol in it. Just some food for thought, no pun intended. How you eat eggs also matters. I know there are countless ways to have them. The good news is you don't have to stick with just one style. Poached, scrambled, fried, you name it. Whichever you choose, just make sure they're cooked well. First of all, you need to refrigerate them and cook them properly before eating. There's a risk of salmonella with raw eggs. Now that can put you in the emergency room. Boiling and poaching are some of the healthiest ways to eat them. Make sure you're not frying them in butter or oil. That only increases the calorie count, but also raises your cholesterol. So, how many eggs should you eat in a day? Experts suggest eating one complete egg per day or two egg whites. You can make lower cholesterol scrambled eggs for your kids by combining one full egg with an egg white. That way, they'll get a lot of protein without missing out on the nutrients found in the yolk. Are there any fried egg fans in the house? That's all right, you can eat fried eggs once in a while. Make sure you use non-tropical vegetable oil like olive oil or canola. These are certainly heart-healthy oils. Steer clear of bacon grease and butter. There have been studies on the long-term effects of eating eggs daily. They found out that an egg a day might actually keep the doctor away. Nearly half a million Chinese adults were examined over the course of nine years. It was found that eating up to one egg a day lowered the risk of heart disease and stroke. Another study found that eating at least a dozen eggs a week for three months had no impact on cardiovascular risk factors, even for people who had type 2 diabetes and pre-diabetes. But remember, the participants in this study were also eating a healthy diet. Still unsure about eating eggs? Maybe you need to learn about their benefits in full detail. Eggs are a powerhouse of nutrition. I know I just mentioned their protein and vitamin D already, but there's so much more to them than just that. Eggs are famously high in nutrition. They have to be considering the egg needs to have all the nutrients to be able to convert a single cell into a chicken. Outside of vitamin D, eggs also have vitamin A, B2, B5, and B12. They have over 20% of the daily requirement of selenium for your body. One egg also provides a good amount of folate, phosphorus, and iodine. Worried about cholesterol found in eggs? Well, don't. Cholesterol from eggs doesn't affect blood cholesterol levels. Sometimes eggs get a bad rap because they come packed with cholesterol. When you eat one egg, you get 212 milligrams of cholesterol. This is nearly the entire amount of cholesterol you're allowed to take in a day, which is 300 milligrams. However, the cholesterol you get from eggs does not increase the amount of cholesterol in your blood. Research has shown that around 70% of people who eat eggs see no change in their blood cholesterol levels. Even in the remaining 30%, there was only a mild increase in bad cholesterol, or even total cholesterol. You want to hear another secret about eggs? They actually increase your good cholesterol levels. If you're wondering where all the cholesterol that you get from eggs goes, they get converted into good cholesterol that your body can use. Cholesterol is divided into good cholesterol, or HDL, and bad cholesterol, or LDL. When you have a higher HDL cholesterol level, you have fewer chances of suffering heart disease. 
You also reduce the risk of stroke or other health issues. Eggs can help increase your HDL. Research shows consuming two eggs on a daily basis for a period of six weeks raised HDL by 10%. Do you want to reduce your chance of getting heart disease? You need to eat an egg! Eggs also contain a good amount of choline. Choline is an important nutrient that your body uses to make cell membranes. Also, choline helps signaling molecules in your brain. It also has many other important functions. Despite its importance, not a lot of people are aware that choline even exists. This is likely because choline is more often combined with B vitamins. If you're suffering from choline deficiency, you'll display very serious symptoms. Fortunately, this is rare. To make sure you don't fall short of the choline your body requires, you should eat eggs on a regular basis. When you have one egg, you'll get as much as 100 milligrams of choline. You'll be surprised to know how good eggs are for your eyesight. They're rich in vitamin A. As you get older, one of the problems you face is a fading eyesight. However, there are a number of nutrients that can help you deal with these effects and keep your eyesight intact. Antioxidants, lutein, and zeaxanthin are two antioxidants that can work on your eyes. Consuming enough lutein and zeaxanthin through your diet ensures that you don't suffer from cataracts or other diseases like macular degeneration. One of the best sources of antioxidants is egg yolk. In one study, participants consumed one egg yolk a day for just under five weeks. Results showed that doing this increased the level of lutein in your blood by around 50% and zeaxanthin by as much as 142. Newsflash! Eating omega-3 rich eggs can bring down your triglyceride levels. Just so you know, triglycerides are a type of fat in your blood. Any calories you consume that you don't need right away in your body will turn into triglycerides. While eggs in general are very healthy, you can get even more out of them depending on what kinds of eggs you eat. When the eggs are from hens, then they have been on pasture, or they've been given food packed with omega-3. You'll be giving yourself more omega-3 fatty acids. When you have these eggs, you'll be able to reduce the level of triglycerides in your blood. This means your chances of suffering heart disease go down significantly. Research has shown that eating five of these enriched eggs every week for a period of three weeks brought down the triglyceride levels by around 18%. And that's a pretty big deal. You already know they're packed with protein, but it's not just protein. It's quality protein. Protein is a very important nutrient for your body. It serves as the building blocks for all of your body's tissues. Without the tissue, your body's not going to function properly. It's necessary that your body gets enough protein through your regular diet. Eggs, for instance, are a great source of quality protein. When you eat even one egg, you'll get as much as six grams of protein. When you have enough protein, you'll also be able to reduce your weight, bring down your blood pressure, and increase your muscle mass. Pretty cool, right? Do you want to bring down your chances of getting a stroke or heart disease? Well, you need to be eating more eggs, folks! As we mentioned a little earlier, eggs increase your level of good cholesterol. The more you eat, the better your HDL is. While your chances of having a heart attack or cardiovascular disease go down, you're less likely to have a stroke. Research among 275,000 participants showed that eating eggs did not result in a heart attack or stroke. If you're following a diet low in carbs, eggs can bring down the risk factors related to heart disease. Are you trying to lose weight? Well then, eggs will come to the rescue. Another advantage of eating eggs as part of your regular diet is that it makes you feel full. This is because of the protein in eggs, which can keep you satiated for a longer time than other foods. If you're eating a serving of eggs, you're not gonna be as hungry. In one study among women who were overweight, it was seen that consuming eggs rather than bagels for breakfast increased their feeling of fullness. As a result, the participants also consumed much fewer calories than normal over the following 36 hours. So it's no wonder that eggs rate so high on the satiety index, which rates foods based on how full they make you. Eggs should not be feared. They make a healthy part of your diet. If you're worried about your cholesterol level, there are plenty of other foods that you need to know about. Did you find this video interesting? Let's keep the conversation going with a couple more cholesterol-related videos, shall we? Here's what you need to know. Check out 7 Foods That Help Lower Your Cholesterol.
Or how about 11 foods that are dangerously increasing your cholesterol? Go ahead, click one, or better yet, watch both and learn more about foods and their impact on your cholesterol. Do you eat eggs regularly? Let us know in the comments below.